Tonight, despite a major U-turn by the government on the farm laws, with the Prime Minister himself coming on TV to announce the rollback, the farmers' agitation remains on the boil. A massive Mahapanchayat in Lucknow today, in pole-bound Uttar Pradesh, where farmers raise the stakes, pressing for making the government's support price a legal right. An earlier demand now being reiterated with renewed vigour. The government has so far not agreed to this, but let's first listen to what Rakesh Tikeyat had to say. MSP ka sawal hai. कानूनी गारंटी उसको मिल जाए इसमें ना छोटा किसान है ना बड़ा किसने दस क्विंटल पैदा करा किसने सौ क्विंटल पैदा करा उसका लाभ सीधा उसी को मिलेगा Now the government hasn't agreed to this so far saying that farmers anyway are getting the minimum support price Now while there's enough evidence and we'll get to that in a minute to suggest that farmers in fact struggle to get the support price making the support price a legal right is considered a complex business. What exactly are the farmers asking for? They're saying need to make it illegal to buy below support prices and penalties for those who violate the law. Currently, support price is not legally enforced. Farmers say that the support price should be set for all crops, unlike currently where it's just only for 23 crops. So do it for all crops and make it a legal right. Now, can this be done? Maharashtra tried. In 2018, they experimented with penalizing anyone who trades below the su support price. The penalty was a one-year jail term and a fine of 50,000 rupees. But the decision was reversed after traders protested, saying, how can you buy below quality produce at a minimum support price? But why are farmers still so anxious about it? Remember, only Two out of six major crops right now are selling above the support price. And farmers don't get support price on most days. That's one of the reasons driving the anxiety. Let's look at the data compiled by my colleague Maria Malavi. This is government data. Crops currently selling below support prices. Ragi, 33% less. Bajra, 30% less. Maize, 6% less. Paddy, 4% less. Only wheat and barley are selling at 5 and 20% respectively above the support price. Let's look at days that farmers got the minimum support price in a particular cropping season. For rice in Chhattisgarh, just 1 out of 151 days. In UP, just 5 out of 151 days. Tamil Nadu, 6 out of 125 days. Telangana, better slightly, almost 50 out of 150 days. West Bengal, 66 out of 151 days. AP, 144 out of 145 days, so that's got a good track record. Rajasthan, coming to that in a second, but Punjab, 62 out of 62 days. For wheat, Rajasthan, 0 out of 120 days that farmers got the support price. Madhya Pradesh, 4 out of 122 days. UP, 4 out of 122 days. Punjab, 23 out of 41 days. Haryana, 34 out of 34 days. So Punjab and Haryana are doing better. As we speak though, government sources indicate that the government is weighing its options about making MSP as a law. Should they make it statutory or should they go in for guidelines? This is what sources are telling us they're considering.